Namaste children, Shweta here. Now we start today's class. See in your previous class, we already started chapter 4 that is basic geometrical ideas. In that few exercise we already solved. Now let me see what do you, let me continue that only. Let me see what do you mean by circle. See you know that uh, there are many objects around us, right? In circular, in shape, right? You can see a coin, you can see a bangle, you can see a wheel. So many are there around, surrounding us. A circle is defined as collection of all points on the plane that are at equal distance from the fixed point. See, uh, if you want to def uh, define a circle means, circle is a collection of point. See, if you put like this circle, uh, point, after that if you draw a circle, so here so many points you are collecting, right? Circle is a collection of point. Circle is a collection of point on the plane. See, this is a plane. This is one plane on the plane that are equal distance from a given fixed point. See, for example, this is a fixed point. See, from here to uh, circumference, here to this uh, circle point. See, here to this point, here to this point, here to this point. So many points are there upon the circle. So from fixed point to any point on the circle, if you measure means that will be having equal distance from fixed point to any point on the circle. So it is having fixed distance. So you are defined a circle. A circle is a defined as collection of all points on the plane that are at equal distance from the given fixed point. You are collecting all points and you are drawing a circle from fixed point where you are keeping you know, from fixed point you are drawing a circle. So from fixed point to any point on the circle it is having equal distance the fixed point is called as center of the circle see this one you call it as center of the circle and the fixed distance this fixed distance see if you see year to year year to year this point year to this point year to this point if you draw a line so there it will be a radius a circle divides the plane on which it lies into three parts see circle is having three parts see what are those let me see inside of the circle on the circle the circle means on the circle and outside of the circle see inside of the circle you call it as interior of the circle interior outside of the circle you call it as exterior outside extra exterior means outside of the circle the circle uh, and its interior together form a circular region i already told circumference means the circumference of a circle is actual length around the circle see this is a uh, circle the boundary of the circle actual length of the circle is called as circumference its length of the edge of the circle traced on, uh, under center of the circle okay actual distance how much is that that is only called as circumference what do i mean by radius let me define a line segment joining the center of a circle with any point on its circumference see this is a circle from center to any point on the circle if you draw so this is only called as circum radius of the circle a, a line segment joining center of the circle with any point on the circumference of the circle i already told this circle on the circle is known as called as circumference so from fixed point to any point on the circle if you draw a line so that one is called it as radius and chord what do you mean by chord a line that jo joins two point on the circumference of the circle i told circumference means this one so any two points any two points if you join so that will become a chord any two points if you join on the circumference of the circle a line join that joins two points on the circumference of the circle see here any two points on the circumference of the circle if you draw so that and all you, it will become the chord okay 
let we see from the figure identify the center of the circle the three radii a diameter a chord two points in the interior and a point in the exterior a sector let we see a segment see in the circle so you have to um write what the center of the circle is what uh, center of the circle is denoted as o the center of the circle is o three radii which are the three radius here see the three radius are see oc1 radii and another one oa and ob see oc oa and ob are three radius a diameter which is called as diameter ab is called as diameter diameter means l uh, two points two point two points that joins through see a line that pass through a center a line that pass through a center is called as diameter okay now a chord which one you call it as chord see d chord is d and a sector is what you call it a sector a o c a o c is called as sector see this part you call it as sector sector means part see yeah, in this this one you call it as part no so sector d uh, segment segment means d see here uh, this one you call it as segment You're cutting that, so it is segment. A point in its interior is so interior. What point is that? O. A point in its exterior. Which point is that? Exterior is C. F. F is in exterior. An arc. Arc. You know that. Which one you call it as arc means A C. You call it as arc. Say true or false. Two diameter of a circle will necessarily intersect. See, it is true. Two diameters of a circle will necessarily intersect. See, if you draw a circle, see this is one uh, diameter and this is one diameter. See, these two diameters of a circle will necessarily intersect, right? If you draw a two uh, diameter, so it will be intersect. each other the center of a circle is always in its uh the center of a circle is always in its interior yes so it is also true center of a circle always it is in interior of a circle only thank you